everybody, Sister Fantastic here, and welcome to Self Care Saturday. I'm excited. I have an allure box that I ordered. This is a one from their members portion of the their shopping uh, section of their website, and they had this box from October, which I loved, and they had it uh, as an offer, and so at a terrific discount. So I picked it up. Plus, I got. A couple of other products to get the free shipping and so I want to share those things with you also I'm going to um, uh, have another giveaway so stay tuned to the you know later on in the video when I give you the special word for that and show you what the item is and then look over on my community tab where I'm announcing the winner from last week and I had some um, Javi coffee that I was giving away for that, for those of you that entered, you know, uh, before the deadline, which was last night, the Friday night. So, anyway, lots of content today. I am gonna put on some skincare. As you can see, my cheek is flushed. I do not know why. This is so weird to me, where one side of my face will get really warm and flushed, and the other side is like cool and not flushed. Go figure. Anyway, this, swatch right here is my new lipstick from Lorella, which is like a mousse texture and it is waterproof I have washed my hands I know a half a dozen times since I put this on when was it yesterday or the day before I don't know anyway I'm just you know haven't gotten any oil to um, to take it off with yet and so anyway I'm just been testing it out and it's like the forever lipstick so anyway when I get around to putting this on in a makeup look for a, a video I'm doing in a couple of days you're gonna see that on me so just imagine that bright red lipstick for Valentine's Day for a Valentine's Day look okay let's get into this I'm gonna start with some perfume because I have all these wonderful vials of perfume this is English laundry called pink um, Pink Brilliance from Scentbird. Let me get it going here. This is one of those ones that the sprayer kind of is messed up or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, I've that hardly ever happens. But that one right there, it doesn't feel like it's spraying out a whole lot. So you saw me go in a couple of extra times. Okay. I want to, there's an array of products sitting around me. I could go in with a number of different things, but I want to share the contents of this box that I just bought. And one of the products that's in the box is one that I already have in my collection that I absolutely love. It's the reason why I bought the box, and it's the Flannery Lily Bloom Hyaluronic Vivifying Serum. So, we're just going to go right in with this. This is a beautiful product. It's bougie. It's like, I don't know, $90 full price. Anyway, Allure had it as a part of their editor recommendations. And I can see why. It is just gorgeous. I've used this and used this so often. And it's... it's since it does have hyaluronic acid in it, it really helps to retain the moisture and it's just, it's an amazing serum. I just love it. It's one of those ones that you just want to reach for and reach for. So anyway, I'm going to put that on. Hopefully we can get some calmness going here on this side of my face. And I'm just going to take this on down to the decollete area and rub that in down there as well okay so for lips today while that's soaking in i'm going to put on some lip balm this is the valley balm sweet coconut and orange lip balm it's kind of thick i've used it before y'all have seen this on my channel uh, i've used it quite a few times on sunday night skin treats here lately it's just a good good lip balm it doesn't take much it's thick and it stays on and it's the kind of lip balm that you know if you put it on before you go to bed it's going to be 
your lips are going to be hydrated again in the morning. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's wonderful. Okay, now I'm going to use a little retinol. I have this one from Medic 8. It's uh, called Crystal Retinol 3. comes in this tube right here. And I'm going to use a couple of squirts of that. And we're just going to put that right there on the tips of my finger. It's kind of a yellowish orange kind of color. And I'm going to focus this on the areas where I have the most wrinkles, which is the sides of my face where it's dry. And then, of course, my forehead and around my eyes. And then just spread it out from there. Get these places right around my mouth. And just rub that on down too. This is a good serum. I really like it. Very, very nice. Okay, now while that soaks in, let's work on our cuticles. I've got this cuticle cream from Pomme. Love this. It is like the best cuticle cream I have ever used. I can't rant and rave enough about it. And you guys have seen me probably use this before too, but I just use like a little dot on each one of my fingernails there at the cuticle line. And then I just rub it all in on each nail and take what's left on my fingertips on up the fingers. And if there's anything left over, then my tops of my hands get it. So we're just doing a little skincare little hand care. I got some products that uh, that I've been trying for my hair. Um, got another one or two ordered. And of course, y'all really don't want to see me fool with my hair too much, but I can talk about them. I can come on and talk about them and, uh, you know, tell you what the results were and how I liked them and all that kind of thing. When they, once I get through testing, this is smells amazing it's got like aromatherapy kind of oils in it or something it just smells so good and it's so invigorating and it works and it keeps the hangnails from forming it's just that wonderful it helps my nails grow and it coats my nails and the nail protects the nail bed and it's just such a great cuticle cream i highly recommend it I believe you can find it at pomme.com. Let me just double check that here for you. It's called M My Pomme. M-Y for like my, P-A-U-M-E.com, My Pomme. Anyway, if I, if I remember, I'll link that down below in the description and that way you guys can get to it. Okay, I've got a little bit of eye cream left from Kinship. Maybe enough for today. Let's test it out and see. I'm going to use a little eye cream and hopefully empty this out and put this into my empties because I have, ooh, I got a good squirt. Yay, good squirt. Anyway, I haven't really been focusing on trying to empty too much out. I've been trying new stuff and anyway, I need to get back to using some things that are open. Anyway, I'm just gonna put this cream on top of that retinol that I laid down and get really good and saturated around the eye socket and go on down the circle of my eye right here where those lines want to try and form whenever I'm tired. I feel good today. I've rested well the last couple of nights in a row and I think there's still enough in here for one or two more uses. It's like this little tiny sample has just lasted and lasted. And uh, so anyway, we'll just keep using it till it's all gone. But anyway, the weather here in Savannah, it feels like spring, y'all. It's in the 50s and 60s this week and down into the 30s and 40s at night. We had maybe one night of frost, but it wasn't, you know, I mean, it's not spring, spring yet, but it feels like spring. We had some warm rains. We got some more warm rains coming, and it's just, um, it just, 
is today's Groundhog Day that I'm filming this and the groundhog did not see a shadow in Philadelphia or in Pennsylvania wherever the name of that town is and uh, but here it's been sunny so I think we all go by the one Punxsutawney Phil the city that he lives in all right now I've got some hand cream that I want to use I've got this jasmine and rose hand cream I'm gonna put some cream on my hands and then we're we're gonna get into this box y'all so a little bit of hand cream and I'm excited to share this box with you all I'm just gonna rub this on up my elbows my skin it's just been a challenge this winter staticky dry hair it makes me want to just cut it all off because it knots up and you know it's been a battle especially with the hair okay I think that's I need a moisturizer but I'm gonna let this stuff soak in for a few minutes and then maybe we'll come back and put on a moisturizer anyway this little tin right here that I got from the Walmart the fall special edition called beauty space yeah beauty space anyway it's a little upcharge it goes from like $7.99 to $12.99 and this tin is where all the products were and I've used this tin and used it and I have loved it so let me just set this tin down and <clears throat> show you what's in my box here real quick of course we got the Flannery uh, Lily Bloom Hyaluronic Vivifying Serum which is the reason why I bought the box so excited about this box now the variation that I received is a bit different from the one that I had back in October back in October I had a scrunchie that was like a I think it was like a leopard print anyway I gave it away and they're satin they're really pretty but they're a bit th on the wide side which my hair is not very th it's thin it's not very thick at all and I feel like this would really be beneficial to somebody with you know really thick hair so anyway I will probably wind up giving that one away as well and then there's the masking and relaxing moisturizing scalp ma mask which I'm all the time using you know hair masks and scalp masks so I'm glad to have this as a part of the box and then there's the anti chafing stick from first aid beauty little deluxe sample so now I have two of those. Um, this is a variation item. This was, this is called the Root Concealer for Blondes. You just spray this in and cover up your grays. So I'm excited to try that. Then there's the Pure Skin Facial Cleanser from First Aid Beauty. That's a variation item as well. So I'm getting, you know, all products, a lot of the products that I didn't get in my first box. So I get to try those. And then there's the Caudalie Eye Cream, which I've been using this on Sunday nights. It's called Premier Crew. I love this, so I'm glad to have a backup of that. And then, let's see here. Let me set these. I've got a couple of extra items. Let me show you the last item that came in the box. And then I'm going to share the extra items with you. This is a... I hate to open it up because I'm probably going to give it away. It's the blush. It's called Don't Blush Me Blush by Parada Jones. Anyway, I know y'all want to see it. But you won't care if I... open up this little plastic seal box, uh, bag and I'll just tape it right back down or fold it right back down anyway it is considered a safety seal but I'm not going to use this I'm, I'm going to um, give it away because I already have one so let me find something to open this box with it's a really pretty color It's called Suit T's Suit of Armor. 
Well, I am struggling, y'all. Just to try and get this box open. Here we go. Well, I can't even get it open because there's this, this sticker right here is a safety seal. Anyway, that is the color. It's a really pretty color. It's um, like a, it's a powdered product and it's, it's like a, um, it looks really dark right here. But anyway, we're going to try it out with the one that I kept and we're going to give this one away. So look for that in a future giveaway. Anyway, I'm just going to pop it right back in this bag. I went to all that trouble, y'all, for nothing. But anyway, wish I could have showed it to you. If I thought, I would have brought mine over here. Okay, and then the two products that I picked up so that I could get the free shipping. Two single products. Uh, another one was the Flannery Lily Bloom Hyaluronic Vivifying Serum. So I got a, a another one of these. That's how much I like it. So, anyway. And then the other product was the Tarte Waterproof Shadow Liner. Um, it's like a duo stick. So you've got a shadow on one side and the liner on the other side. And the shadow is like a really pretty, like a shimmery kind of a peach color. And then the liner is like a really super dark brown like a black brown anyway super excited to get this I love Tarte products all right so the giveaway for next week oh and there's also a coupon in here for hello fresh so I like to give those away with my giveaways if you want it all right so my giveaway for next time is going to consist of this beautiful satin scrunchie love this color and then of course the blush, which is a beautiful, like a reddish brown. And of course you can apply, apply it very lightly with a uh, fluffy brush. If you use a big fluffy brush like this, you can just barely tap into the product and you know diffuse it on your face really nice. And you don't have to worry about getting, you know, and blend it and you don't have to get, you know, overdo it on your, on your skin. So anyway, I'll probably add a couple of sheet masks to this and maybe a surprise item and just round it off and have um, you know a nice little bag of goodies to give away so this particular giveaway is going to run for one week from now until um, this next Friday because I have to have all the entries in by Friday night so that I can post the winner on Saturday and uh, so for that that particular let's use the word uh, brown brown in the comments leave a full sentence leave the word use the word brown in a full sentence and that will let me know that you're interested in the giveaway you get get the items that i mentioned and then of course the winner from last week of the javi coffee is going to be uh, posted drawn and i'm going to draw a winner at random and I post the winner over on instagram this came in a package that's already sealed and I don't want to break the seal and enter a thank you card or uh, put a bookmark or anything else in it you know because it's a whole lot easier just to you know put a new label on this existing you know I don't want to mess up the packaging so that the person that's listed on my community tab will have 48 hours to claim the prize and uh, in the comments on my community tab and then send me a DM and let me have all their, you know, personal information, you know, legal name and address and all that kind of stuff. All right, all my rules are listed down below. I'm not gonna go into the whole spiel. Y'all know my deal, you know, and uh, I do go by, I follow my own rules. Let's just put it that way. So make sure that you're publicly subscribed and that, you know, you follow all the rules. Okay, I am going to put on a moisturizer now. Now that that's had a chance to soak in, I'm going back in with the Olay Shea Butter and Peptide. Love this. And uh, peptides, for those of you that don't know too much about peptides, peptides have a 
smaller stem type molecule and so even though a cream can be thick and heavy like this one is it can actually help uh, your skin absorb collagen and retinol is one of the best things you can use to help absorb collagen as well a lot of people prefer to use collagen from you know to ingest it which that's probably the best way but you can use it topically it's just diff it's a large molecule though collagen is and it's difficult for it to absorb and so if you um, use products that have peptides in them and retinol then it will absorb a lot more efficiently so just a little tidbit of information there for you I'm trying to I don't want you to feel like it's hopeless you know we all wear these collagen masks all the time and we need we need collagen you know to help our skin cells to reproduce and turn over so anyway just remember that peptides and retinol with it so if you use a sheet mask when, you know that has collagen in it you, one of the ways that you can get it to absorb is to use a moisturizer that has peptides in it you could use uh, another serum um, before the moisturizer that has retinol in it and you can you know benefit from peptide from the collagen in a more efficient way but don't get me wrong peptide you know collagen is very hydrating and nourishing to the skin even though it may not absorb you know by itself down in, you know and penetrate because of the large molecule but you can get it to break down a lot better when you use it with peptides and retinol okay that's it for me today you guys uh, leave me a comment down below give me a thumbs up on the video please Woohoo! me and mr. fantastic say thank you very much anyway we're headed into this Valentine's month happy Groundhog Day everybody you'll have to let me know um, if you feel like where you're living at is gonna be six more weeks of winter or not down in the comments I believe it's gonna be spring here in Tennessee very very soon all right God bless you all today is my prayer and I will see you in my next video bye